Yo, what's going on YouTube? I got a good one for you today. I'm going to show you 5 creative ways that you can light your board games only using a flashlight. Let's get into today's video. So hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And if you're new here, my name is Clayton. And on this channel, we have fun with board games. Before we begin today's video, I just want to go back in time a little bit. So just a little bit over a month ago, on Victory Point Labs YouTube channel, they did a community board game photo challenge. Everyone had to take a picture of the game Ticket to Ride, only using a flashlight and no Photoshop. And I thought it was so creative to only use a flashlight because not everyone has a fancy light setup. For me, I don't have that much of a setup. I use my phone to record most of my videos. I have somewhat of a basic light setup, but for the most part, I have fun just taking pictures of my games using my phone and some basic lighting. I had so much fun with this challenge, I thought I would share it with you guys on the channel of five different ways that I came up with that you can light your board games at home, only using a flashlight. I know with the Victory Point Labs community challenge, it was supposed to be only with a flashlight and no Photoshop. So with this video, I'm gonna show you the raw photo that came out of my phone and then a Photoshop edited version after so you can see what your photos could look like with a little bit of editing. Let's start with photo number one. So just like in my other video, 5 Creator Ways that you can take a board games only using your phone, I'm going to show you how I edit these photos at the end of the video. Stay to the end of the video if you want to check that out. Anyways, let's move on to photo number 2. So I was looking around my house and I saw I had this and this just goes like in a candle holder um, and I noticed it had birds on it. Immediately I thought about ring span. What I did is I ended up using a light to cast a shadow on the board game and I used a mirror as an angle shot to kind of come up with something a little bit different. I know there's tons of photos of wingspan out there but I thought this one was different and kind of cool and I want to share it with you guys. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, and you're new here, hit that subscribe button, and give this video a like. It helps the channel grow, and I really appreciate it. I know I say that in all my videos, but it's true. You guys do rock. Now, let's dive in to editing those photos.
All right, I hope you guys enjoyed those five creative ways to light your board games only using a flashlight. And if you guys haven't already, go check out Victory Point Labs YouTube channel. They got some really good stuff on there. I'll leave them linked in the description box down below. All right, that's it for this week's video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll catch you guys in next week's video. Take care.